idea of drum by baby for a long time. When people think about lullabies, drums are hardly the first instrument that comes to their mind. But as a world percussionist, I've always been interested in slow grooves and softer sounds, so the idea of matching and marrying drums and percussion instruments with the lullaby experience, that's something I've always found intriguing. When I became a father, rhythm and drumming became an important part of my relationship with my daughter. I played a large drum, like this, uh, this bell run, just moments before she was born. Sort of welcome her into the world. And then when she became older, of course, playtime was all about drumming on things, and nighttime became very special as well. That's when I would pull out softer instruments like little thumb pianos. We would uh, sing lullabies, and of course, did a lot of waltzing uh, over the years. So pretty much all the songs that are on the CD are written about experiences with my daughter. <laughs> dozens of percussion instruments that were used on Drum by Baby, there were certainly a few that I felt really helped to lend that lullaby flavor. Uh, one of the instruments that was used was this, uh, this udu, uh, or a friend of mine calls it a, a u-bang. This is a Steve Wright hand drum. It has a really mellow uh, sound. And then to provide some, uh, some tonal structure and harmonic structure, some other interesting choices were made. This is a, a tank drum, a garahan from Argentina. And then I, I know a fella, Jim Doble, up in Maine that makes these wonderful xylophones. Uh, one is made of stone that was also used in the project. Uh, this particular one is made of glass. It's very soft, um, but it's used on, on a tune called A Noche. So those are some of the softer sounds and some of the more interesting instruments that were used on Drama by Baby. Well, for now, I'll be spending a little less time in the recording studio and more time trying to wrap up some other projects I have on the table. But what I love about recording music and putting it out there, especially with great online independent companies like CD Baby and other online resources, is that once it's out there, someone can discover it today, tomorrow, or a hundred years from now. And it's really my hope that this music finds its way into homes all around the world and that it helps to provide great rhythm experiences and musical memories for families uh, for many years to come. So 